Before we begin, if you are new to this channel, click subscribe. For you to receive updates about Jazz Tech videos, hit like below and share this video to your friends and family. If you don't, this terrifying creature will knock on your door tonight. I'm doing it now. I'm going to show you how you can set up the Ring Chime Pro. This is the old generation Chime Pro and similar to the process on how you can set up in the Ring application. And yep, as always, you need to press the setup button on the side of the Ring Chime Pro. The first generation, there it is. You have to press and hold it for only uh, five seconds. Then after five seconds, release it. Then wait for one minute in order for it to set up mode or to enter setup mode. Yep. If you see a slowly blinking light on the ring logo, that means it's ready to be set up. It's in setup mode. The same goes to the new Ring Chime Pro. If you see that, you know, after you press the setup button of the Chime Pro on the side, then hold it for 5 seconds. If you see the blinking slow light on the indicator, that means you are ready to set up for the, the Ring Chime Pro and the Ring application. Open the Ring app. If you don't have a Ring application yet, uh, you need to go to the Play Store. If you're using an iPhone, go to the App Store then search Ring Always Home application and then you just need to click set up a device right there but if you already have or installed the Ring Chime Pro or set up the Ring Chime Pro in the Ring application and it says offline uh, you just need to reconnect it by clicking the Chime go to device health then change network or change Wi-Fi network you have to click uh, reconnect to Wi-Fi. Yes, of course, I'm near to the device and the light is already flashing slowly. And as you can see, it's trying to prepare the setup, meaning it's trying to connect to your Ring Chime Pro. The Ring app is now connected to your Chime Pro. After you connect the Ring network to your Ring app, that is the time that it will scan for available Wi-Fi networks nearby and it's searching for my Wi-Fi network. Mm, it seems like it's having a hard time to connect to the Wi-Fi, but uh, let's give it a try again. Let's see, try uh, continue without the Bluetooth. Then, you know, uh, this is part of a troubleshooting. If in case uh, you're having a hard time to connect your Ring Chime Pro, I uh, just try all the options that you can select in the Ring app. Networks. There it is. Then this is my Wi-Fi password. It will immediately recognize the Wi-Fi password since Chime I already installed and set up the, the Ring devices, so Chime I don't Pro need to put again. To your Wi-Fi network with Ring, you're always home. Awesome! Now I successfully set it up. And then uh, it's still showing offline because it's trying to update the firmware. So let's wait for it. As you can see, it's just uh, reconnected. Click got it. Then if you can see that blue circle in the upper left. Your Chime Pro is installing an update. Some features may be unavailable until the update is complete. You hear that? that yep uh, it's still updating and that blue circle that you can see in the upper left indicating that it's trying to download the latest firmware let's wait for this one and usually it takes five minutes or less but uh, once you complete the setup process it's ready and you can change the settings audio settings general settings and so on that's it guys and if you love this video uh, please uh, hit subscribe below, like and share so that um, I can create more videos for you or tutorials like okay? it. I hope you like it and if you have any suggestions um, or questions you can just go comment down below. Thank you so much and thank you so much for watching. Just tech. Have a great day. Goodbye. There will be a lot of videos in the future. Don't forget to click subscribe to receive updates for the latest videos.
Thank you so much for watching Jazz Tech. Have a great day or good night.